Hey guys, how are you guys doing tonight? Um, welcome back to the channel. Um, we decided that we wanted to do a cook with me video tonight because there was a um, recipe that we saw like a few months ago actually um, that we sent, my husband sent to me um, and he, he saw it on Facebook. And um, we went by the grocery store today and got some Brussels sprouts and we were like what can we do with the Brussels sprouts just kind of make them a little bit funky so um, We decided we're gonna do Garlic creamy garlic Parmesan Brussels sprouts so um, It looks really good. I can link the um, Recipe well not link it. I can post the recipe down below um, because there's no link to it Like I said, it was like six months or more ago that we sent it to one another but um, I'm going to walk you through it and um, show you how it's done and then show you the final product. And it's going to go with our dinner tonight and I'm looking forward to it. All right, stay tuned. Okay, so basically all you need is... Um, bacon which you're going to pre-cook and then you need the brussels sprouts um you need the brussels sprouts garlic mozzarella cheese parmesan cheese heavy whipping cream and a little cornstarch and water to thicken the sauce up and salt and pepper to taste so that's pretty basic right now hubby's cutting up the bacon so you're going to go ahead and saute that up and then set it to the side and then we'll get the Brussels sprouts going with the rest of the mixture. Chop them lengthwise, get off the ends, and he's already got his garlic chopped. And um, then we're going to throw them in the pan with some butter. We already cooked the bacon. Um, so just going to throw the butter in with that, you know, pan juice, as we like to call it, and um, get these bad boys going. They're about to get really happy in a second. All right, so I'm gonna cut, put a couple of pats of butter in. Somebody likes butter. I got a lot of, uh, what's that stuff called? Brussels sprouts. Oh, is that what it is? Yeah. <laughs> I thought you were doing a Paula Deen. Hey, you know what's up. All right, so we're gonna get the butter going. We don't know her for real, though. <laughs> we really don't. <laughs> We don't endorse. <laughs> oh, yeah. So we're going to get the butter going, and then we're just going to go ahead and throw the Brussels sprouts in. Oh, fancy. What you got there? Good old Rachel Ray, huh? Oh, yeah. <laughs> now she, I can endorse. <laughs> She's a cool girl. So we just half them, putting them in. And we're just gonna mix them up and let them start getting happy, happy, happy. And at this point, you can start to sprinkle on your salt and pepper. We'll probably add a little bit of cayenne because we like everything spicy around here. Amen. <laughs> That's why you got me, huh, babe? <laughs> <laughs> like so basically, we're just eyeballing it, guys, because that's just how 
we cook for the most part. So, um, like I said, I'll give you a estimate, a guesstimation of um, the recipe, or I'll try to see if I can find the original recipe for you guys. For those of you that like to cook with an actual recipe. Let's see, it's taking on those pan juices. It's starting to look real nice. So we'll just let those cook down for a little bit. Until and the then in. we're going to get the garlic going in as well. Just gonna stir this up really quick, give it a quick cover, let the Brussels sprouts start to come together, and then we'll continue on with the um, heavy cream in just a little bit. All right, so it's coming together nicely now. Just watching that garlic, make sure it doesn't burn. We're starting to cook up real nice. Meanwhile, back at the ranch, Hubby is cutting up some fresh Parmesan. Now we have some mozzarella. And then we're about to get the heavy whipping cream. I'm going to do about a cup. And then in a separate bowl, I'm going to mix up a little cornstarch and water to help thicken it up a little bit. So I'm going to get ready to do that right now. Okay, so I'm just putting a little cornstarch in to make a little thickening agent. And then we'll just set that to the side. And if we need to, just add a little bit more. And then I'm about to pour the cream in. And get that going. So this is about a cup of cream. Just pour that in. And then we're going to add the um, bacon back in and let that go. Let that come together. Let that thicken up a little bit. That nice crispy bacon down over it. Let that all come together. Gonna let that cook for a second and then we're gonna add in the um, cornstarch mixture. And then after that, we'll put the cheese in and it'll all come together. Let's see, it's been a couple of minutes. See how it starts to bubble? It's getting super creamy. That looks really good. And then we're just gonna put just a bit of the thickening agent in. And then I'm gonna add the cheese in. And right now these are still, um, you know, they've got bite to them. So that's where you want them. You want them a little bit soft on the outside, but nice, have that nice bite to it. Now I'm gonna add the cheese. We like our stuff cheesy around here. Now I'm gonna put a little mozzarella in as well. And I think I may put a little bit more cream in this one. So we had a pretty big batch of the uh, stove down. We want to have it on a lower heat at this point. That looks pretty good. I'm going to add a little more cream to it because we had a larger batch of the, um, of the Brussels sprouts. Okay, 
And that just needs to come together and that's it. And I'll show it to you once it's plated up so you can see the final product. Just let it sit for a couple of minutes. I'm gonna put a little to the side and somebody is ready for their plate too. That looks so good and it smells even better. Somebody's hungry. You ready to eat? eat? You want to eat? Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's go sit in your seat. Well, you can do that later. Emma. That's not your seat. Where's your seat at? <clears throat> Where's your seat? Where's your chair? That's not it. No, oh, she's like, I'm taking that seat. Your big chair. Where's your big chair? <laughs> All right, so this is the final product. This is what we're having for dinner tonight. It is um, roasted um, Parmesan rosemary potatoes with uh, baked chicken thighs and that creamy bacon Brussels sprouts, Parmesan Brussels sprouts. It looks wonderful. All right, guys, we're about to eat. Thank you.